Hi guys, in this video Libby and I are on our way to hopefully see a wintering windshed, which is very rare in the Netherlands. And I also want to give you an update for my plans for the channel in 2024 and birding in general. And in particular the patchwork challenge in which I will compete. Working on my eternal month list isn't a priority for me, but when there's a cool species close by home, it's always tempting to go. It is accompanied by a couple of common stone chats, which is also a species that winters more and more in the Netherlands. I've walked quite some distance now, but I haven't seen any chats. So let me first tell you about the biggest change uh, for my channel in 2024. As you've noticed in my latest videos, I'm going back to English, just like I started my channel. Sorry, you can hear my daughter on the background. She's playing uh, with a pacifier. But uh, where was I? Oh yeah, the biggest change for my channel in 2024 is that I'm going back to English because the English language has a much greater reach than the Dutch language. For the upcoming videos I will make custom Dutch subtitles and see in the statistics how much they are used. If they are used much, I keep on going through with that. But if not, then I may skip those in the future. Well, I'm back at the car, haven't seen any chats. I thought I heard a common stone chat, but wasn't sure. So let me tell you about the other thing for 2024, the patchwork challenge. The patchwork challenge has been going on for a couple of years in the UK now. But last year some Dutch birds participated and I thought, well, we can do it also next year in the Netherlands. So what you have to do is uh, get a local patch, maximum of 10 kilometers from your house, of maximum three square kilometers. You have to bird that intensively next year and try to find as many birds as you can. Hopefully some very rare birds will be seen. My daughter had enough of uh, the stroll, so I've decided to go home. But first I'm going to do a round in the Onlande to show you parts of my uh, patch for the patchwork challenge for next year. Here you can see my patch for the next year. As I do regular walks in the area, I had to be a bit creative to stay within 3 square kilometers and also include a large part of the route I take in it. So if I encounter a bird during my walks, I can count it. Although the rules state that you can count everything you see from inside the patch, even if the bird is outside the patch, because my patch is a bit stretched, I will only count the birds that are outside the blue lines if I can see and identify them from the road without using any optics to keep the competition fair. I also included my house, a small patch of wood, and a large wetland area. The best birds seen in this area over the last years are Pallet Harrier, Black Winged Kite, Squacko Heron, Little and Balen Scrake, Lesser Yellow Legs and the rarest being a Cinerous Vulture.
I just came across another bird who told me there was a whooper swan in one of the ponds here, which is actually a new species for the patch. So let's hope it'll stay till next year so I can add it to the patch list. Are you also participating in the Patchwork Challenge next year? Let me know in the comments. If you want to see more of the Dutch Burner, have a list of the best videos in the description.